What's good, PK gang? gang? It's your boy Peyton. And your girl Kayla. Out here with, with another, another video. video. What are we doing today? We are doing a mukbang. I'm super excited because this is our first mukbang. And I always thought they were weird, like what people wanted to see you eat and talk. But we're also going to be like doing a life update mm -hmm. as well. So it should be kind of informative for you. And if you like mukbangs, then great. <laughs> Quarantine things. Also, yep. we haven't eaten a single thing all day. So I'm yeah. going to throw down. We are so hungry. Tell them what we got. <laughs> so we got sushi from uh, one of my favorite places out here called QQ Kitchen. Our and place, Toro Sushi. They ran out of rice. How Tell me, what, what type of sushi restaurant runs out of rice? Yeah. Crazy. Anyway. Yeah, so we got some sushi, we got some shrimp ramen, and we got, I have a, a cherry vanilla Coke. And I got that vitamin water, triple X, you know. I'm ready. Let's eat. You gotta do this with the chopsticks if you don't know. Sometimes though, you get the good chopsticks, but you don't gotta do that. You can tell if a place is, well, not really. That's not true. My, my dad always told me, you can tell if the place is good if they got fancy chopsticks, like good chopsticks. Not yeah, that's what you've always told me. Quick a bye bye. Can you rip this off? It's gonna bother me. Bye. Yeah. Mmm. You know me. This is what I needed. Okay, so shall we dig into the conversation? Mm -hmm. So, life updates. Babe, do you want to tell them our plans for like when quarantine's done, I guess? When quarantine's done, we'll be kind of talked about that. In the vlog, but we can talk on it like more right now. That's true. So while we've been on quarantine, we've been like trying to get pre-approved so we can move into a house and get out of this apartment. And they said, once things go back to normal, because currently Kayla's unemployed, um, well, laid off. She'll yeah. have a job when she gets, when this is all over. Mm -hmm. But because of that, it kind of affected like whether or not we can get approved. Yeah. But, no, yeah, so we're gonna try to get into a house. Um, what else? That's, that, I'm excited for that. Yeah, we're super excited. So like, the plan is, we want a starter home so that we can like renovate it mm -hmm. and like within like five years go ahead and turn around and sell it you know and More gain like out. yeah and have like equity you know so yeah we're gonna buy like basically a shit home and then not shit but, not shit, but like you know like a starter not, home yeah, like it's, not it was, gonna be no it's gonna need work you know mm -hmm. and we're going to his uncle's or into that, like tell them. Like. Oh yeah, my uncle, well, my uncles um, own a business called Putney Building Company and they flip homes. And the last one we did, well, last one I did with them, I think they flipped it and sold it for like $600,000. Mm -hmm. Which, maybe where you live, that's not a lot. Here it's kind of, that's like pretty high mm -hmm. for here. Mm -hmm. But yeah, it was a nice house. It was yeah. huge. They do, like, your they uncle do does a really job. good job. Yeah, shout out my uncle. Shout out Putney Building Company. Yep. For real. One thing that I really want, that, like, Peyton has to make happen, is a nice ass bath. Because I take baths all the time. Do I not? You I do. take, like, a bath every day. Pretty much. Close to it. So I want, like, one of those baths where, like, you sit down and your boobs and your knees are covered. Mm -hmm. And like, it's comfortable, you know? Like it's cozy. So, we need to make that happen. We can make that happen. Okay. I'm a plumber, baby. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. That's a big bite. Mm. I was so hungry. Me mm too. -hmm. I'm about to throw it down though. Mm -hmm. Like this, there ain't gonna be nothing left. For real. I'm eating everything. Mm -hmm. mm. Ooh. You okay? I'm about to choke! <laughs> oh my god! By the way, this place is good. Yeah. 
This is my first time having this, this place, but it is good. Wait, let me try. Um, what else about the home? We're gonna try to get Cuckoo into training. Mm hmm. Cuckoo update. So, Cuckoo is huge now. We're gonna do a video where we do like a cuckoo, an actual Cuckoo update. Mm -hmm. But she is. How big? Like 25 pounds? Yeah, 25 pounds. Down. If we go back to Down. our video when we first got her, like she's just like massive now. Mm -hmm. Like she was just a little baby back then. These are good. We're still kind of struggling with the potty training thing, but she's done a lot better. Or a lot, a lot better. Mm-hmm. She, like, I'm not gonna even lie. I'm not even gonna front. Like, I was getting real fed up with her. I'm not she gonna lie. She was not ready to get rid of her. For real, because she was, like, shitting on our couch. She shit on our couch. She shit on his leg, like, on and him. On my phone. On his phone. I had to get rid Literally of Literally every 10 minutes. I kid you not. Every 10 minutes, it was either poop or pee. Like, <laughs> we were just cleaning after her. Like, that's all we would do. That's all the day would consist of. And I was, like, not having it. But it kind of was our fault because... She learned to go outside on the puppy pads, like on our deck, and then we switched it up on her and was like, okay, you need to go outside, like in the courtyard, and that just fucked her up. Like, she, she did not understand. She didn't. Mm -hmm. Like, after we switched it up, like, she, like, forgot everything we taught her, and I was like, I'm not going to be having our stuff ruined because you want to act dumb. Yeah. So yeah, I'm not even playing. It, I was this close, but now, like I said today, what did I say when we got home? I can't imagine coming home and not seeing Cuckoo when we get home. Mhm. Mm For real. She's, she's our, our baby. Kayla says she's my dog, though. She's not your dog. Mhm. Mm she's not your dog. Mhm. Mm I want to get another dog for her, like when we get our home or whatever. I want her to have like a little playmate. She wants a little baby dog. But I do want a baby dog. But she's still, she's our dog. Poop butt. But, yeah, I seriously, I love her so much. She's really smart, too. Oh, yeah. Like, and well, and the reason, like, I, I want to get her into training so that she can learn. Because, like, I've taught her, go, go get down. 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 Good girl. Good girl. I've taught her how to sit. How to lay down, how to stay, how to get down. And but she's like, what? She's like six months, so she's she still like learning. Yeah, she's learning. Yeah. When it's hard because we got her when she was only six weeks old and she didn't get to learn much from her mom. So it like. She yeah, we took her way too soon. But they were selling her way too soon. Yeah. This is so good. Yeah, it is. But no, she's a good girl. Mm hmm. But comment down below what other like little dogs are good to get. Cause like Peyton wants a French bull or yeah, French bulldog. I'm not doing it. I have too many problems. Yeah. Um. Yeah. One time, my cousin. Well, my cousins, cousins or something like that. They got a French Bulldog, and I went over there, and she was all breathing like, <laughs> and I was like, oh my god, you're annoying. So yeah, I'm not doing that. What's another good little dog? Mm. Her parents have a Boston Terrier. Mm-hmm. He's a good dog. He farts a lot. But he's a good dog. Sit down. And he's wild. Sit down. He's got energy. You don't really. You need. You need a dog that's gonna like sit there and cuddle you. Yeah, I do. And he ain't that. Arlo? Yeah. Arlo is. Arlo mm -hmm. does both. Yeah. Arlo does both. Ask my mom. My mom cuddles with him all the time. When we watched him for that, like. But that was that was because we watched him. Like we're not his parents, you know. 
Dogs are gonna act differently. Cuckoo, get down. Cuckoo, down. Go eat your food. Go eat your food. She ate all her food. Mm. Cuckoo, where's your bone? Get your bone. Where's your bone? Look, go get your bone. Go get your bone. I'm trying to think, there was something I was gonna say. I'm gonna try this one. Oh god, I don't even know how to grab it. Mmm. Mm. Okay. <laughs> wow, that mm, good. I think this top's tore up. Mmm, it's a little bit hot. I think it does. Salmon. That one's like very salmony. Like you can definitely taste the salmon. Like. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Anyway. What else was here? Um mm, our wedding. Oh yeah. Our wedding is being postponed. So we don't know when. We haven't come up Sadly. with another date. I'm not trying to push it out like until next year. Our date for this year was 10, 10, 20, but the Rona really got us messed up. And yeah. like it put us way back when it came to like saving and stuff. So yeah. But I don't know if I wanna wait like all like another year, you know. I know. I was hoping to be married to you this year. I know. But hmm. everything happens for a reason. Mm -hmm. It does. So I'm dropping stuff. I ain't tripping too hard on it. Yeah. You really don't think this is better than Toro? It's good, but I definitely actually miss Toro. Like it's good. I think it's good because I haven't had food all day, and it's good. <laughs> but. Toro is number one, for sure. You gotta go and like actually sit down there though. Cause I'm pretty sure this one right here. That one actually might be a little too much for me. This one comes on fire. Mm, that's cool. Like that's why it's in the in the foils, cause like they light it on fire and it comes out like on fire. Mm. I'm kind of getting full. Don't say that. <laughs> I know. Don't it's because we didn't eat anything all day. I hate when that happens and then like my eyes are always bigger than my stomach. So I was like, let's order 50 rolls. Like, oh my God. It's okay. I can do it. <laughs> what else do I have to talk about? Mm. I'm not working at Mac anymore. Oh yeah. Yeah. I don't, like, we made a video about that, remember? And then, like, I never talked about it again. Yeah. But, not working there anymore. It honestly was not a good experience for me. Like. Well, you learned a lot. I learned a lot. And, like, I don't know. Like, I love to do the makeup part. A thing but I've never liked retail like I used to work retail when I was in high school and I hated working retail like everybody knew that like it was just basically a job for me like you know yeah. and so I told him before I even started I was like I don't know like I might not like this because it is like just because I work at Mac I also worked at Nordstrom but like Nordstrom was number one so I still had to like make my sales and stuff like that and I don't like pushing stuff on people like I don't like that whole like I don't like that energy so I already knew but he was like you know like it doesn't hurt to give it a try like you don't have to stick with it if you don't like it and I was like you're right well then I was having like issues with my because I worked at um I was still at like a restaurant as well like I'm a waitress and so I was working both jobs and it was just like I had conflicting schedules and then I had one boss getting mad over here and then another boss getting mad and it was just like really stressful yeah. and anyone that knows me knows like I have crippling anxiety and depression so like I try to handle those situations the best I can but like ultimately like if I'm under pressure or if I'm stressed for a long time like a long period of time 
it's all gonna just spiral out of control yeah yeah for real and that's exactly what happened and you know like it sucks because i feel like i didn't even like end on good terms with mac mm -hmm. and that's what's really crappy is like i did have i basically was told that like how would you even describe it to you? like i don't want to throw nobody under the bus here but like basically like you ruined her reputation because she's the one that hired you and that she thought but it was like we needed to make money mm -hmm. we weren't even making money when i was at that job because like i would go there and it was 12 dollars every time to park and i was only getting part-time hours and then it was kind of a drive too so we're like losing money there and then when my other boss was like, hey, I need you for this day, like, that was just so stressful. And, I don't know. I don't know. It's just, I'm glad that it's over with. Yeah. Like, I can always do makeup on the side, like freelancing, but. She said, I thought you were better than that. She really was throwing shade. She was. Hello. I was you like, didn't do mm -hmm. nothing. You didn't do nothing. Funny. Oh. Which was funny, too. More no nothing, like. Another thing, Coco, get down, please. It was funny too because with this whole quarantine thing that's been happening, like, and me being la laid off at my other job, like at my one job, my only job now, mm -hmm. excuse me. But with that happening, I had to file for unemployment. And so I filed for unemployment. Well, yesterday I just got, like, well, first and foremost, it has been taking so long for me to get this money. I, I filed five weeks ago yeah. and still have not had like a seen, penny. yeah, a penny. And so I was like, why is it taking so long? Well, then it also like, it kept saying pending, pending, pending. And then like a junction or something, whatever that word was, a remember a junction? And we're like, what is that word? <laughs> and then we looked it up. Was. Well, we looked it up and it was like, an employer is like trying to fight this or something like that. Mm -hmm. And I was like, what the hell? And then literally yesterday, five weeks after, like my money has been held on to because of this, yeah. I get a notice saying that like Mac, instead of resigning, which I resigned, I put my two weeks in, they have my two weeks letter, Nordstrom and Mac fired me. But in the unemployment thing, it says that we're still allowing you benefits or something like that because like basically Nordstrom and Mac couldn't give them a reason as to why I was fired when yeah. I've ne I was never fired from yeah. that job like she resigned. what the freak <laughs> so very shady yeah. very shady yeah. and now I can never like put them on my resume which whatever I don't even, I don't even care but I probably wouldn't have even done that anyway it's just because the lady was throwing shade on me but like don't lie especially when your ass knows i put my two weeks in mm -hmm. like you have my letter like you never fired me i was never fired so annoying but that's the beef she on that was, well i don't want to put it out there too much it's over with it's done with it's in the past but yeah cook it down no doubt down shady stuff man yeah Cuckoo, get down. Get, get down. You know you're not on the table. You're not allowed on the table. Get down. Good girl. Um, get down. She be doing this every time we eat. That's why I want to get her into training too. Because <laughs> I don't want to be hitting her. But it's annoying. Get down. Get down. You want to go kennel? You want to go kennel? What else, babe? You don't really ever talk about your job. Hopefully, I'll be going back to work by May 8th. Mm -hmm. And I've never, I never thought I'd say this. Like, I mean, I like my job, but I actually miss working. Like, I'd be hella tired because I work a lot. And yeah. it's hard work, but yeah. I miss working. People don't realize that, like, Cuckoo, 
Get away from the camera. People don't realize that though, like, you need to work. You need routine yeah. in your life. Like, it's important. So. Yeah. Doesn't surprise me. Like, I haven't been able to sleep. I have not been able to sleep. Last night, Our I sleep literally are so laid right in bed. <laughs> like, she was passed out. I think she passed out at like 2 in the morning. But I was on and off because I knew that you were like rolling around. Yeah. But... Yeah, she like fell asleep at 2.30. We went to go to bed at like 2.30. And I sat there and stared at the ceiling, looked out the window, like just looking around till like, I didn't fall asleep till like 7.30 in the morning. Yeah. It was terrible. Crazy. Terrible. I hate it. Mm-hmm. Sorry, this was a really big bite. <laughs> Mm. We need to get you on a schedule though before you go back. Mm -hmm. It has been kind of nice though. Mm -hmm. Being able to spend time with my best friend. I know. Because when I am, I got. It's okay. When I am working, we barely get to see each other. It feels like we get to see each other for like five minutes. That's not true. That's what it feels like. You can drop me. No, it's been nice, but... She's ready for me to go back to work. <laughs> no, I'm not. I will miss <laughs> you. I was thinking about that the other day, like, oh my god, what am I going to do with my life, with myself? Because I'm home a lot more than Peyton. Like, I only work, like, two days out of the week, and then I'm home the rest of the time, like, by myself. And so, when this, like, all came about, the whole quarantine thing... I was so bored by myself. I was like, what the heck am I going to do? And then I was like, it wasn't good for my mental health. And then the day that his like work called, I was like, okay, like, there's a stay at home order. I was like, yes. thank God. Because <laughs> I literally told you that day too. I was like, I'm, I need you to be home with me. Like, you know? Yeah. So. I was kind of excited too. You I was were. really excited. You were. Are you going to eat more of this? I don't think so. It's kind of too much. Well, I'm going to eat it then. Oh. You want some of this too? Where's that? I'll take the fish part. <coughs> no, no. <coughs> Here, you take this Excuse whole one. Me. Take that whole one. Thanks. You're welcome. But another exciting thing, guys. I... I'm going to once this whole quarantine thing is done, Coco. We don't ask you like 20 times, girlfriend. Hey, get down. Get down. Coco. Good Go girl. Good Go girl. So once this whole quarantine thing is done, I am going to be going to the studio and making music, guys. I'm so excited to like share that with you guys like music is my passion i've been writing i've been writing my life away like during this whole quarantine i've like made 15 songs i swear i can't wait to record show you what's up what's good and yeah i'm excited about it that's gonna be good real good and real i don't good. think he's just saying that because he's my significant other no it's good are you mm -mm. You know me. Music's like my life. I know. You know I'd be talking about hella trash if you weren't. I know. You'd be like, babe, you can't do that. Babe. Babe. <laughs> babe. Get down. We cannot eat a meal without her up and up. Most. What's your problem? Child. No, we can't have no coke. <laughs> Cuckoo, no. Babe, do you want some of this? Maybe after. I want to eat some more of this one. Oh, shit. Okay. What else? Oh. Get down. Oh, another thing we even want to tell you guys. We already told you probably, well, I don't know if it's uploaded or not, but if y'all get us to 300 subscribers, we're doing a giveaway. So. And it will be a good one too. It's up to y'all. It ain't up to us. We gonna do it. Y'all have to get us there. 
So get us there, and then we'll tell y'all the details. Mm -hmm. But it's gonna be good. Mm -hmm. We're halfway there, right? No. We're at like 108 right now. Oh. Stop. Go stop. No. I haven't eaten this good in a minute. Like been this full. What? That that was like shade on my cooking. I've been the one cooking. You have been the one cooking. You threw shade on my cooking the other night. No, I didn't. You said it tastes burnt. Oh, <laughs> the chicken. Yeah. The chicken, the chicken did. Slap. That chicken was good. I don't know what you're talking about. That chicken was burnt, babe. It was so soft and moist, though. <laughs> moist? Cuckoo, stop. You're really pushing me off, girl. Cuckoo? Mm -hmm. She's fucking crazy. I'm full, though. Yeah, like, I'm, I'm full. I'm right there with you, though. I'm stuffed. Mm-hmm. I didn't say I didn't like your cooking. I thought that was some shade. No. I was about to say. When do I throw shade at you? Hmm? Never. Exactly. Cuckoo! I'm done with you. I'm done with you. Okay, y'all. Well, are we pretty much done anyways? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <clears throat> We are done eating. Hopefully that was a good, is it mukbang? I think it's mukbang. If not, I'm sorry. Leave your comments below on how we could improve. I know that you probably want to see the food. So next time we do a mukbang, we'll move y'all closer and we'll actually show y'all the food. Yeah. Um, but yeah. The boy's full. Yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed like the little life update thing that we gave y'all. Yeah. Too. So now y'all know like what's going on in our current life, where we're at. Oh. What? Yeah, I know. What? I was gonna say we finished Breaking Bad, but I don't even think we told them that we were watching Breaking Bad. I think we did. did yeah. We? Yeah. Oh, we finished Breaking we finished Bad. Breaking Bad. That we're on to Ozark. Yep. Yep. Season three. <clears throat> yep. We're moving up in the world. Yep. But oh, yeah. yeah. Hit us up with like since it is quarantine. Hit us up with some good movies or shows to watch on Netflix. Because we'd be bored. Yeah. Yeah. Also, let us know if you guys have any, like, video ideas that y'all want us to do. Mm -hmm. I know someone commented the other day they want us to do, like, an arm wrestling video. And then they, like, took it down. And I was like, girl, we can do an arm one. wrestling video for you. Like, if y'all want. But I'm pretty sure it's obvious it's going to win. <laughs> so, anyways, we can do an arm wrestling video for you, girl. Like, I saw that comment. I don't know why people do that. There's been a few times where like people will comment and then they'll take it down. It's like, no, comment those things. Like we want to hear what y'all are thinking. Yeah. So, yeah. Anyways, so if you haven't already, make sure you like this video. Make sure you're subscribed. Come on, join the PK gang. We're fine. Yeah. Um, and anything else? Did you say ring a bell? No. Ring that bell. You already know why. Post uh, notifications. What's, what's, yeah. <laughs> <Turn your laughs> ring, post that, ring that bell. <laughs> so you know, when we post, you can be the first one to like it, first one to watch it, and let y'all friends know. For real. Share the love. Mm -hmm. Get us to 300. So For you real. can get that giveaway. For real. So, we love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching, and we will swoop. Swoop? Swoop? Okay. We love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching, and we will see you in the next video. Bye, guys.